Yo, what up? It's the infamous text right here at the Hustle Town Network. Another episode of Behind the Hustle, man. You know, I got my co-host right here, DJ Sauce Park. What's do, man? It's DJ Sauce Park up in here. You know what's going down. Me and infamous text. We got my girl, Alex Marie. That's right. Alex, Hello. what's up? What's up? What's up, Hustle Town? Oh. Man, you know what? We, we, we've had you plenty of times on the show before on Hustle Town. Like, you've been featured a lot of times. They definitely, if they know Hustle Town Network, you know Alex Marie by now. Uh, but, man, you won this straight out of Texas contest right here. So this is our winner right here of SOT7. Man, c- congratulations, by the way. Thank you. I was I was shocked. I was like, wait, what? Yeah. I didn't even believe it. <laughs> well, you've made it to the to the like to the top hot five before. You know, you pretty much each time you damn near got close to winning before. Yeah. So it's just one of them things to where, you know, we've saw her face plenty of times on the show and she she got it. You know really? what I mean? That's what happened. Hey. That's the consistency though. You didn't give yeah. up. You didn't get a hold a grudge. We've had you know, people that do that, don't hey, win. You took the words right out of my mouth. I was just I was just gonna elaborate on that. You know, you yeah. hey, can't win all of them, man. You can't win every time, you know. Yeah, yeah, keep, keep uh, you keep going. coming. Uh, yeah, but, and, yeah, and eventually you, it happens. Uh, you yeah. know what I mean? Like I, t- I tell everybody, everybody's not gonna like your music or what you do, but somebody gonna like it. Yeah, <laughs> hey, so, uh, yeah. somebody gonna like it. You just gotta find, you know. Yeah, you gotta find that right that that right direction. Yeah, and you know we always there's always one or two that we don't ever see again no more. They hit the unfollow everything, but, but when they don't win, I'm just <laughs> like. Just, Man, you don't you don't know. I mean, you you just couldn't come with the right song. Sometimes you may have a good song, but maybe it's not right for the performance. Maybe it's more exactly. of an album cut instead yeah. of a single to us uh, yeah. or whoever the judges are. There's every, always different judges. It's every just, song's not a performance song anyway. Right. I mean, it's really not. I mean, at the end of the day, yeah. But you, you can know. make it a performance song. You like, can. I came in there and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna win that necklace. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, that's what I did. Uh, yeah, <laughs> shout out to Ace Town Drip right there. I see yeah, you rocking Ace-Town it right Drip. there too. Yeah. Bling you know? bling. Shout out Lil Wayne. Every time I come around, <laughs> yeah. y'all say that bling bling. Yeah, go check them out over <laughs> so, at acetowndrip.com. Yeah, too. If y'all want to check out more jewelry right there, check out what he's got going on. But man, so the song that you performed, tell me, tell me a little bit about the song you performed. Was it something like a new song you had just did? Was that something you were already sitting on? Well, tell me about it. Yeah, um, I wrote it. Uh, it's called Comeback. Mm-hmm. Um, I was more like writing it to like, I guess, talk my mess to, you know, everybody that kind of like doubted me and they didn't see the vision that I saw. And so I was I was going to go on there and just attack everybody. Yeah. (laughs) Make sure they feel it. (laughs) And and, and in time like now, right, we have a lot of, uh, you know, lady artists out there, female artists right now. We're not we don't have a shortage on them. They're all coming out right now. A lot of people are making some noise, you know, uh, uh, you know, with a. a roster like that around Houston, man. We got some heavy hitters, man. But you know, you're on the stage, sharing the stage with a lot of these same people. You know, how do you feel? You know, with what you do, because you also model. You do other stuff too. You go up there, you like you say, put on a show. You come out there, like you know, ready to win this thing. And <laughs> no, know, that's a real show. Like she put on a real show. Yeah, like real deal. Like so I, like you paid to go to the concert. Yeah, and you. You get your money's worth, you know what I mean? Yeah. For real. Uh, yeah. How, I mean, how do you feel, though, as far as with other artists out there? You know, everyone has their method, their you know, their their style, their, you know, how they want to, f- you know, put out their music. You, you're marketing yourself every way, basically. I mean, you're into everything. Like I said, the, the art, the art, you know, artistry part, the music, I mean, uh, uh, the modeling, everywhere else. You know, you're tapping in everything. How do you, how do you battle all that? Like, the juggle um, all that right there, like. Honestly, it's, I, I love it. It's like. I've, it's all like a it's a passion you know um right. i love to model i love to sing i love to rap i love to act so i guess it's like i guess i love to be in front of the camera i'm mm-hmm. like i'm like put me in front of the camera i'll right. show you a, a show yeah. <laughs> i'll give you a it's show just, it goes all <laughs> hey, but that's the difference though that's the difference in somebody like got the passion like me i love what i do and somebody just like hey I'm going to be a rapper. I'm going to get rich you know what i mean like that's like their main mindset is the you know the money part but yeah. when you really passionate and you love it, like you know, you'll do it. We'll, yeah. all of us in this room will do what we love. Man, you know how many times paid? That's you know how many times I've been like, man, yeah. man, I'm, I ain't gonna do this. I ain't gonna do this no more. But hey, yeah. I, I can't. Yeah, like, you can't yeah, quit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And when you got the passion, like yeah. I said, man, you're gonna do it one way or another. Um, you're gonna, you know, yeah, you're gonna be everywhere you gotta be. Uh, and you've had a hell of a year. This is basically still your first year. We're still in 2021. When, when did you officially start doing music? Was it 2021 or already before? Or? Um, I feel like at the end of 2019. Okay. Is that when I had like my first show. And okay, yeah. okay. And when I stepped on that stage, I was like, okay, no, this is it. I never tried it before. I was nervous, but it was, it all just came. Like yeah. I was destined for yeah, it. Yeah, it just clicked after a while. And, 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 
It sounds like with all the stuff that you're doing, you're basically in love with the, the whole the, the culture, the Houston culture, the Houston culture, the cameras. I mean, it's just a whole different For life sure. of its own. It's a lifestyle. It really is. Hey, yeah. people don't want to understand. If you ain't never been here, you wouldn't understand it. <laughs> Everybody from the outside looking in, they just, you know, they yeah. think it's all crazy. And, you know, even though, you know, they secretly in love with our culture. I know that. Yeah. But, <laughs> yeah. Hey. Yeah, yeah. It's a lot own, of people moving it, in Houston. Houston is his own world, bro. <laughs> we are yeah. we, <laughs> fifty cent in town now, you know. Hey. And, and you see, uh, you know, all our Houston uh, rappers, Paul Wall, Slim. Now they're opening up. That, one like, thing, they're it, our, they're part of our culture. And one thing about Houston, I can't say that we show love to everybody. You know, you ain't got to worry about coming to Houston. And hey, you see somebody, hey, one of these celebrities, one of these rappers, or somebody, hey, everybody yeah. showing love. You know what I mean? For yeah. real. So the, the first time, I guess you made your, your Hustle Town debut was at the end of last year on the first straight out of Texas, which you, you were on the very first straight out of Texas, right? And you've been mm -hmm. on a couple of, I want to say at least four straight out of Texas, right? You know, she's came in, yeah. dropped singles every time, new singles every time, mm -hmm. you know, put on a show every time, came with the outfit, everything. She's always put 100% into it. Uh, and then what, she finally went straight out of Texas 7, which, mm -hmm. again, just a testimony to, to, to not – Stopping, not giving up, man. Always yeah. coming through. Big shout out to Thea, by the way, man. Uh, oh, hey, yeah. you can plug in Thea right <laughs> Hold there, on. man. That's, See, that's, I that's gotta get, we're going to go and get to one of my questions. Because if you know me, everybody know I'm ESG DJ. Yeah, hey, they know plugged in Thea. That, you know, that's, hey, she was with me last night, man. I mean, night four last night, the Wolf Den. You know, we did New Music Monday. Yeah. She know how to rock with us. So uh, let everybody know what's your affiliation with plugged in Thea. Because they know mine. So what's yours? Oh, well, that's my mom. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's that's my best friend. That's my manager. That's, you know, she's with me through everything. And every show she's there, you know, even if we're just both of us by ourselves, like For real though. we're still we're still going to pop out, show out. And hey, you know. shout out plugged in to you. She know yeah. I love I love that lady, man. <laughs> Yeah. Come on with that. She feed me and everything, man. Yeah. We need to drop the IG so they know who. And it's OG Thea uh, on Instagram. OG Thea HTX, I think. Yeah. There you yeah, go, right that there. Boom. That's, that's, that's it. It's, that's the, uh, it's OG Thea right there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So much love. Oh, drop your Instagram real quick, too. If they're not following you yet, drop the. You have a new Instagram. Yeah. Right now. I had to make a new Instagram because they hacked the other one. That's so. how you know you're jumping, so, though. That's how you know yeah, you're popping when like... you're getting hacked. <laughs> Straight up. So what happened? What actually happened when they hacked it? Um, You know, you just don't click on any links people send you because uh, they will hack you. But, um, yeah, they just got into my profile. and But, you know, I'm not really like, it's okay because, you know, people people know my name. Yeah. And, mm -hmm. you know, the real fans, you know, the real supporters, they're going to always, they're going to always be there. You know, They're going to come find you anyway. Yeah. Yeah. And it makes me just want to go push harder than I already was. But the new Instagram is um, Alex Marie underscore HTX. Okay, there you go. Yeah. Alex Marie underscore HTX. Man. So, yeah, the uh, you had a whole bunch of stuff going on this year. Really, you've been all over the network, you know, a few times. You started with the... Uh, with the uh, well, straight out of Texas on the contestant, but then just a couple of months later, you're right there on the Valentine's Day concert, and you kicked that one off, which I think was a big, you know, one of the things a lot of artists don't like to be one of the first ones to perform certain stuff, but when it came to a virtual concert, that's where you want to be is the first one to perform because you're always going to get seen. It was it's it's kind of reverse. Yeah. Then, then had right. you been performing a live show, you're going to want to be performing towards the end there, the right. headliner. This one, yeah. it was a big thing that for you to kick this show off right here too, and you got a lot of attention. A lot of people got to see you because if not, some people get skimmed through. They'll skim through, and you you could be yeah. missed or overseen. This right here, man, it was I think it was a good position right there. The song, the song was good. So tell me about that first song you performed on on the uh, Valentine's Day show. Yeah, it was a slow song. Tell me about it. It's my uh, single, Greater Things, mm. and um, yeah, that song meant a lot to me. It means a lot. Um, that was actually the first song that I ever wrote and recorded. And and then when I did that, I was like, wait, okay, I could do music too. I'm yeah. like, Hold on. Was that the one you performed also on the first contest, Straight Out of Texas? Uh, the yeah. The one we did all there too? Okay, yeah. I did. So it already kind of, it was already kind of like stuck, you know, like it had one of them ring, ear yeah. or whatever. It stuck to you already. So when mm -hmm. she performed it at the uh, at the Valentine's Day virtual, man, it was a good visual. Plus, I think you were the first one to perform in that new studio we had just got at the time. That yeah, was our first. So that was our first concert in that new virtual studio mm -hmm. so you were the like very first one who got to, to break the mic in there so <laughs> that was dope first female uh, for sure oh yeah for real real talk. yeah shout out shout out to everybody that was a really dope concert everybody that performed over there um so you've been getting used to just performing you've been getting i've seen you on a lot of flyers you're back to back i see you with some fights going on right there sauce I, oh yeah oh, yeah oh, we gotta get in that 
<laughs> yeah, I missed that the other night. Oh, yeah, let us know what, what's up with the fight, G Love. I know I seen a little video clip, a couple of things. Hey, yeah. that, was, that was dope. We, um, G Love had came to me and um, we were talking about an event that we wanted to throw, and she was like, Well, I think it'd be a good idea if we have like a fighting match and then perform our song after. And I was like, Oh, that'd be good. So, yeah. you know, we're just trying to get the crowd, like, you know, interested and all that. So, we went at it for four rounds. There was only a, a minute around. So, so y'all had put people performing before the fight or what? Yeah, we had um, people perform before and then I think halftime and then at the end too. Right. G, well, G-Lo's so, a marketing genius. g Love, yeah. the marketing genius. <laughs> I like that, man. That's so the big, the big question is who won the fight? Um, You know... I feel like we both had to be there. I don't yeah. want to just say. I mean, they, yeah, didn't judge I it. they didn't have a judge at the end, or they just was just pretty much like, hey, was doing it just to do it. Yeah, nobody really judged at the end. Like, so. It's like, like a charity fight. It's just, yeah, just yeah that's what I mean. Yeah. yeah. It's, more one, like, yeah. it's more like you got to watch the whole fight so, and you be the judge. Cho- yeah. So, y'all going <laughs> to do it again or what? No, we're not going to do it again. Um, she's actually going to go against Lady Choppa, another female artist. Uh-oh. Okay, shout so, out Lady Chop. We've seen 4th. her a few times on the network. She's uh, definitely working. The whole G-Love movement, too. Like I said, man, that's an awesome whole event. The fact that you yeah. even got out there, too. You know, so, hey, hey, for real, artist, man, hey. model, boxer. You hey, know what I mean? Like, y- hey, y'all don't want none of her, man. I'm and, and, and y'all hey. did some training, too, before this, right? Or how did, hey. this, y'all, did y'all? But you should know, though. That's to your daughter now. You you already know you won't play with her. She'll knock your ass out. You see, that she, yeah. she, that's your mom, mama. Hell, yeah. Yeah, you yeah. see, she ain't playing no game. Yeah, tell me yeah. about the process on that. Did y'all, did y'all, I heard y'all, y'all trained a little bit or? or yeah, we y'all? did. I think we had like a good month to train, to train, yeah, so. Did the promo and everything too, the social media promo. Yeah, it was like I said, fun. it was a real good event. I'm excited to see the next one. Next one's going down, I believe, what, December 4th? I think that's what, it was December 4th. Yeah, December um, 4th. Yeah, they just had the weigh-in, so, you know, shout out to everybody who pulled up over there. We hope to see y'all out there too. You're, I'm sure you're gonna be in the house. I saw you at the way yeah. in, so you're gonna be in there some way, somehow, somewhere. You gonna be performing? Yeah, um, yeah, I am gonna be performing. Dope. Yeah, dope. And I think we're also gonna have some uh, other performances too. I think Little Mexico, uh, that Mexican OT. Yeah, that Mexican right. OT. So shout out to them. Shout out to everybody who's gonna be there. You know, everybody who's involved with the whole G Love movement. You know, all all the homies out there. We also got a uh, uh, my boy AD and my boy um, uh, fuck. Damn, uh, Antonio Vibe. Sorry, yeah. I got the A and they they was got them twisted. So Antonio Vibe, they gonna be up there boxing too, doing something. Mm-hmm. So that's gonna be a real dope event. I like See? that. I like the way yeah. that, that everybody's just kind of. I'm just kind of peeping and watching and seeing all the moves getting made. You know what I mean? And Alex, you're in a lot of this stuff, so you're pretty much in the whole you know inner circle of all the artists who are yeah. working in today's era of the Houston hip hop scene. Yeah. You know what I mean? So For that's real? pretty yeah, dope. We're, yeah, we're all working together. Yeah. You gotta stay in that loop. Yeah, mm-hmm. got to. People think that you can just uh, I'm just be an artist when you want to, or be you know whatever. You can't just it's hey, you gotta consistent be, work. Yeah, you gotta you know be what consistent, mean? man. Either you gonna do it or you're not. When, I mean, when you're can't Instagram, just pop out when you get ready. Oh, it's, I'm, I'm I'm gonna make me a song now. No, nah, nah, it don't work like that. When your Instagram <laughs> got hacked, what uh what uh where were you at already on following wise? I know you were up uh, there. You're I was like twenty something, almost fifteen point six. Yeah. Okay. Well, it was still she was hitting some numbers yeah. in a short amount of time, basically. So that's how you know she's working. Yeah. And consistent with it. So yeah. keep doing that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just keep doing your thing. Really? Uh, you know, it's going to come. You know, don't worry about the Instagram eventually. I know I, oh, yeah. I ain't been a victim of that yet, and that'd probably break my heart. But, man, it, it, you can you'll get past all that. Don't think you said. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to wood on that one. Don't die. <laughs> yeah, for real. We ain't doing that. Um, so tell me about the visuals. I've seen a couple of videos. or I've seen a uh, video. Tell me about what you got out exactly right now, music video-wise. They can check out on YouTube. Everywhere else, you know what I mean? Yeah, I have um my single Eternity. Um, I have a visual for that one by Ace the Shooter. Okay. He filmed that. Hey, hey, he's yeah. he's good. Hey, he's a good uh, videographer too. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, he do a lot of Southside Hoodlum. Um, back when he first came out, yeah, you know, I chopped and screwed a lot of his videos. That's how I know. I seen it. But, yeah, yeah. And it was fast. I think I got that video in like two days. Yeah. And um, also I have a short visual for Don't Call My Name. Um. That one, my best friend did that one for me, <laughs> but it's on YouTube also. Um, and I'm about to drop another one for my other single comeback, mm-hmm. and that's the one I won for Straight Out of Texas. Okay, okay dope, dope. Who, who gonna shoot that one? Uh, Trap Visions, 
That boy Trap. Shout out Trap Vision. Trap stay working too. Hey, my boy, man. Busy one out there too. No talk, real, uh, real talk. That's my boy though. Yeah. Shout you still have another one also still coming. That's going to yeah. be another one that we're going to add to the list from artistic productions as well. So, oh, yeah. you know, when you're ready for that, holla at us. You know, we got you on that. Uh, you know that one's going to be fine too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, yeah. So this time of the year, man, it's the giving seasons. You know, we're going to be doing a whole bunch of giveaways, stuff like that, as far as giving back to the community. You know, we definitely got to have you pull up to some of this stuff, too. Oh, um, yeah. Right now, we're, uh, this. Is, you know, if you're watching this right now, uh, when this does come out, you're going to see that we have a toy drive coming up. That's on December 3rd. December 3rd. Right. But, and that one's going to be uh, brought to you by, Ooh, you know, GT Distribution, that's gonna be- Hustle Town. Straight out of hey, Texas. Hey, it's going to be like a mini concert for pop, real. No, you know, no real 97 talk. 97.9 The Box is going to be there as well. So yeah. we got that going on. Um, but before we do that, that's on December 3rd. December 1st, we got the uh, Hustle Town shopping spree going down in the north side over at the Walmart and the North Line location right there mm-hmm. across Timbers. Now, this yep. one right here, we called out all of our artists out of H-Town. We want them to all pull up. Right, everybody. Yeah, we been say call them out. Yeah, we say call them out. We really called them out. Like, hey, <laughs> you, you, you better be out here. Y'all need, it's time to get hey, back to community. It, I want to yeah. see all my artists get it back to community. There ain't no hey, can you not no. just us. You better be at that motherfucking Walmart. That's yeah, a- <laughs> yeah. You know, so all the artists out there, you know, anybody who's been featured on Straight Out Texas Hustle Time Network, man, we we want to see everybody out there. Uh, you know, filling up baskets at the same time. You know, whether it's buying one toy. Two, three, it's all adding up. We're off. We're filling them all into the 97 on the box van at the same time. Mm-hmm. So every artist. So, you know, I'd like to invite you out there, you know, if you oh, want to yeah, come I'll out there December there. 1st. It's a Wednesday night from 7 to 9 p.m. Like I said, we're going to be out there. My boy South Park going to be in the tent DJing. Yeah. You it's know, we got the, uh, Walmart parking lot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> going to crank it up. Yeah. So, you know, it, it's a. Uh, uh, we definitely got to get you over there, man. How you feel about stuff like that, too? Just, you know, I know, I know uh, you get to do like the videos and. The the, the uh, performances that's that's a lot of the fun part. Even the studio is the fun part for a lot of the artists. Yeah, but man, the giving back part, we oh, definitely yeah. got to include that sometimes too. That's a part of it. Good. Um, no, I, I love that. Um, you know when people get together to give out, you know, but I feel like I do that like on the daily. You know, like that's just that's who I am. Yeah. I love to mm-hmm. help out. You know, and the reason why I'm doing all this, the music, the every you know art, all the art. It's because I want to get be able to give out more to people that you know, mm-hmm. like be able What's to up? do that. Right That's on. how it's supposed to be, for real. Yeah. yeah. So it's, I'm gonna be, be there for sure. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We gotta get a screwed and chop uh, Alex Marie song. Can we get something like that? <laughs> sauce, hey. Some sauce on it. Hey, yeah. We're gonna have to get that visual. For on sure. There. We I'm ready. You know I'm ready. <laughs> Hell yeah. What's your studio survival kit? My I mean, when you're in the, when you're in the studio, everybody has. Stuff that's gonna be with them in that studio at you all times. You gotta time. have it. Was, you can't uh, go to the studio without it. If they call you and say, "Hey, you be like, you gotta have it before you go, or you ain't going." Um, anything, food, drinks, anything. What you gotta have? I definitely probably have to have like one shot, probably okay. before if I do like a rap, yeah. I'll what? take like a shot. Do yeah. what? Or well, at least a we'll bottle, like at least something dream. to have on there. Yeah, yeah. Right? For sure. yeah, that's for sure. Um, that's a good answer. I, I can see that. I yeah. need that sometimes too. <laughs> Recently, or some infamous teas or the text effect shots Ooh. available now. We're gonna you know, we'll talk about that. I gotta, I gotta bring you over there so Look, you can check out the drinks. I bring up the text yeah. effect shot real quick. I don't know, for some reason, last night I kept conf- after I left from y'all, I kept confusing it with Rex in effect. And I was like, text in effect, is it text in effect or no, nah, text te- effect? The, just the text effect, the text that's effect. the shot, the text effect, mm-hmm. which the text, text effect, effect will creep up on you. The text effect, then we got the infamous tea, you know what I mean? So that's yeah. going out, you know. Wait, it's I crown. I got those. crown in both of them. You know, they're uh, some whiskey drinks right there. Yeah, crown. they got those available available at Big City Wings. So you know, that's where we're gonna be after the Walmart. We're having everybody yeah. go back though. We're gonna go to Big City Wings, turn up one time. It's Wednesday, four dollars. Good tea. wings too. Hey, you know, hey, you know, uh, text a uh, food critic. Hey, you better. <laughs> Speaking of food, you better not man. play Let's with the food, food man. Let's just get. Let's just ask some random questions. Get to know more about Alex Marie. Food wise, well, we'll start with wings off top. Boneless or bone in. Boneless. Okay, I don't. That's fine. That's fine. I just feel like it's more uh, chicken. <laughs> I, I'm gonna give it to you because you're a female. I feel like you might not want to well, be as I messy. I, no, it's true. Yeah, true. true. You know Had it been true. one of my dogs, I would have been like, "Well, get the fuck out of here." <laughs> but because Alex Marie is boneless, <laughs> you know, I, see, I see it. It's all good. I'm like, I what do t- I look like? Just like going crazy. I ain't gonna yeah. tell you how I feel. I ain't gonna tell you how I felt last night about the dude eating the boneless wings with a knife and a fork. We'll talk about that later. Oh man, see, I don't do all that. I'm like. Yeah, we be over there a little too much at the, the big city wings and stuff, man. Too much. And Applebee's. Shout out to Club Apple. It be going down. Oh, it was, hey. At reverse happy hour. 
I be going down like, wow, man. Takes over here controlling the damn jukebox with his phone, man. It's like a club. I have my own interest. It's like music. a club up in there, man. Yeah. So, so, so the uh, apps, you know, the the touch tunes, you can download the app and then control now, like the jukebox, but just from your phone, right? And it'll bring oh, the location credits. up, like wherever. So, so wherever you're at. So, you know, wherever I'm at, yeah. It'll say the, Applebee's uh, or whatever. We do the, uh, uh, you know, the entrance music. So I make sure my song's on. Yeah, he got a theme in. song when you walk in that world. That boy don't play, man. Yeah. Somebody else oh, taught yeah, me about that. Cool. Ever since then, they, they got me on, 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 on some other shit right here. So uh, alcohol right here. Uh, what's your favorite alcohol? Uh, alcohol, you know, I guess tequila. I, I, I uh, knew tequila. it. I knew that's it. Thea right there. Yeah, that's I really knew that's it. Thea, hundred <laughs> percent. Don Julio with her. Don Julio all day. Julio over there, man. All day. Shout out to Thea right there. Okay, the, hey, big shout out for real though. That's my dog, man. Love that lady, bro. <laughs> oh God. Hell yeah. All right, so artists, uh, maybe artists you would like to work with or something. You know, um, an artist, whether it's a big artist on the radio, artist, local artist, who's someone, maybe a few artists that you would like to work with. Um. You know, I would like to work with Oh Mona Lay. Mm-hmm. Uh, she's oh, she's really good. Uh, also, D Baby. Yeah, I would like to shout work out with D him Baby. He's killing the game right now too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and um, that Mexican OT. Yeah. Okay. That okay. Mexican OT. He also. You hear? He, yeah. You hear that boy? Ooh, and he was also <laughs> a winner as well. Y'all come. Y'all all winners are straight out of Texas right there. He won straight out of Texas five. A uh, couple. Yeah, man. Yeah, for real. That'll be hard though. I seen you uh, also doing some. Uh, I see. I guess seen you in the lab with like James Houston, a couple like uh, Doug and KB, all them guys. That, shout that, out that James Houston. Duke, that's my boy too. Oh, yeah, yeah. New shout era, out all, James them, all them guys. I'm a dog. A campaign, all that. Yeah, Woody. Campaign, yeah, all the Woody. Woody, all them. Yeah. You been in the studio with them recently? How do you feel? Uh, oh yeah, shout out Woody too. Uh, hey Woody, y'all sleeping on Woody on them beats, man. Woody, yeah. Cook, oh yeah. Woody be cooking, man. He got he got he Doug, hard. Doug and KB won hey. SOT four off of one of hey, his beats. Uh, Woody and James Houston produced the whole Baby Sam album that's been to drop. Woody produced every beat, hey. made every beat on there, and James Houston produced the whole album. Yeah. So shout out to both. Shout out to them, the whole squad over there. For real, yeah. Yeah. campaign records. You know, everything that uh, uh, James Houston's been doing, he's been kind of putting you in, in the lab, but like, you know, doing all kinds of just networking oh, with yeah. each other, right? They mm-hmm. um they produced, James and Woody, they produced um my single, Don't Call My Name. Oh. And yeah, we wrote, well, I wrote that one that night. We recorded it and got that finished up right there. So that was a good one. Um, So yeah, definitely shout out to James Houston and Woody for that one. Yeah, yeah. Slept on, man. They's hard. Mm-hmm. They slept on. Like, oh, yeah. Motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. What about uh, some other musical influences like, uh, you know, the, the new artists that you want to work with? What are some other ones that maybe you grew up listening to that, you know, got Alex Marie, who Alex Marie is today, you know, like the, mm-hmm. that got you, you know, the style, everything. Where does it all come from? Yeah, I feel like um, a lot of like Beyonce, Missy Elliott, uh, okay. Sierra, you know, um, a lot of like girl artists right. I always like looked up to and like I was like, oh, OK, got the dance moves like, you know. Hmm. So I always looked up to that, like the styles and everything. Selena. Um, yeah. Good. That's a good lineup right there. Those are good real, major artists that did some talk. really good things. That's live. So what part of town are you, are you from? For those who don't know, I know the answer, you know what I'm saying? But let them know right quick, you know, more or less where, you, where you're from. Uh, uh, north side of Houston, right yeah. there close to downtown. That's where I grew up. Um, yeah. yeah. Now I live like north North Houston, so. Yeah. Shout out to the North Side, man. Shout out to everybody. I've seen a lot of people, a lot of people rocking with you. You know what I'm saying? The North Side definitely pulling up. They all know about Alex Marie. Every all over town, really. It's been it's been starting to take off. So, you know, if you aren't following Alex Marie already yet, uh, you gotta follow her. Alex Marie mm-hmm. underscore HTX yes. on Instagram, uh, Facebook like page, anything else, other places, TikTok, all that. Um, yeah, like TikTok, Alex Marie ninety nine. Uh okay. Yeah, man, y'all got to get put on to Alex Marie, man. Is there any other, uh, what's some of the new projects coming up? I know we just heard some of the most recent stuff. What's the newest stuff that you're working on? Like, you try oh, to do I a full f- album or just kind of doing single for single at the moment? Yeah, I think, um, well, I'm definitely going to do it in an album um, for my next one. So these next songs, like, they're going to be crazy. Um, I got some new producers who made me some beats that, you know, they're just crazy, and I can't wait to show show everybody. <laughs> I can't wait to hear them because, man, every song you've been coming with has been getting getting better and better. Every time, I think every performance you've done has always gotten one step up, to be honest with you. And even the ones that, that – because uh, I don't ever judge these contests. I can't because of my affiliate – you know, I'm yeah. on the face of the show, so I always got to have different judges and everything. But I've always had my feelings on, you know, what should have been what. And I mean, Alex definitely, she's always, a, you know – 
right there towards the top every single time. Top so, and so. we've been getting better and better. The voice, the quality of the music. I mean, like as far as the recording quality, it's just been getting more and more. So, man, keep it up, girl, because you, you, you really, you really killing it. Uh, you made a hell of a name out here for Hustle Town Network. I know you've been hearing the name. You've been knowing uh, yeah. her name for a while too, yeah. as well, right? For, yeah, I have. See, I knew. I she, she, she probably don't even remember me. I've been over her house. I ate. And everything. See, I, you know what I mean? I've been no, to see. Actually, I do remember. You, see, you didn't give me a ride now home before. You, you, didn't gave me, you didn't drop me an ESZ off before. See, you don't even remember. No, I actually, yeah. now that you said I do remember it. Yeah. So I've been known. I've been, I've been known. Yeah. I've been known her. You know what I'm saying? There you go. That's what I'm talking yeah. about, man. Now, now she, she want, man, that's all I'm just happy. I'm happy that you want a thing, man. That was, that was awesome. Uh, especially the fact that each time you've been, like the whole, the whole, I guess the testimonial part about it. Yeah. The, from from the very first contest, didn't give up. You know, all the man, way to seven, bro. Because a lot of real. a lot of artists, you know, yeah, it's just they they don't want to, you know, they won't go that many times. They're just gonna just ah, uh, well, they're hating. I don't, they don't pick me. They don't yeah, pick, they, everyone has an excuse all the time. Never made yeah. excuses. Never, you know, held a grudge. Never got mad. Always came through and still showed love. Went up there with a good attitude. You know, whether she was performing first, last, you know, wherever she, it just always been good so keep that keep the way you're the way you're working everything's working out for you because of the way you're you know uh your mind pursuing yeah. all this stuff yeah for real. you Thank know what i mean yeah. so keep that up is there any other stuff you want to mention any uh shout outs uh some of the fans need to know um just stay tuned because i got a lot more coming and it, it's i feel like it's just the beginning really and you know a lot of people haven't really even seen what i still got and it's a, I have a lot more to give, so um, stay tuned for that. And shout out to all the people that support me and, you know, stick by my side and go to the shows and show love. Um, shout out everybody. Um, shout out Straight Out of Texas. Mm. Shout out shout out DJ Sauce. Wait, hold Sauce on. Park. Sauce yeah. Park. Yeah. 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 We did it there today. Uh, SPM yeah. called him Sauce Walker there today just because no. he did. Uh, <laughs> no, Sauce no, Walker. Sauce Parker. Oh, Sauce Parker. No. Or he Sauce like Parker. That was yeah. crazy. <laughs> Yeah, that was dope. Yeah. We got to put you on the line with him too, because he's yeah. heard about your music too. SPM, he's he's seen a lot of your stuff. He sees all the Hustle Town Network stuff, by the way. For real, uh, yeah, he has own. He, he got his own channel. Too, he's yeah. sitting here watching Hustle Town Network all day long, so he's familiar with with what you do. Also, mm -hmm. so oh, we're gonna that's be crazy, uh, bro. We're gonna make yeah, some oh happen. God. We're gonna make some happen. You know, on some uh, bigger shows too. Yeah. Also, you already know you family around here too. So you know, we're gonna be having right. you on some more stuff. Anything we gonna we can we can get going. We're gonna get you on. So I appreciate you tapping in with us. Uh, one more time, you got to go follow us, Alex Marie underscore HTX on yes. Instagram. Mm -hmm. uh, check out the the YouTube. Uh, YouTube is there? YouTube. Alex Marie Music. She said. Alex Marie Music. There you go. Okay. Yeah. So Alex All Marie platforms. YouTube. Alex Marie. Alex Marie Music. Got sorry. It. Come on, get it, baby. There you go. All the way off, man. So we right here, man. We wrapping this thing, my boy DJ Sauce Park. DJ Sauce Park in this thing, man. We 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 out of here. That's Alex right. Marie. Shout out to you. Look, yeah. then tell. Shout out OG. Man. ESG, OG. baby Sam. That's man. my click, baby. Everybody, man. South side still holding. We out. Hey, man, what up? It's the infamous text. Here to tell you about my player partners, my affiliates over at Vintage Affiliated. That's right. They got the rarest, classic, exclusive, vintage, hard to find 80s, 90s, and early 2000s clothing. It's open seven days a week, and it's all in a one-stop shop. Check them out online at www.vintageaffiliated.com or pull up in person, 2414 South Gordon Street, Nalvin, Texas, just south of H-Town. They're always featuring a Hustle Town network. Work. So be sure to tell them your boy Infamous Tech sent you. And be sure to follow their Facebook page and their Instagram for exclusive offers and deals you can't find nowhere else.